Brothers and sisters, if you can trust a man in little things, you can also trust him in greater. In other words, if we can be trusted with the material goods that come into our lives and use them to build the kingdom of God, to create a more just and equitable society, then we can be trusted with something much greater to commune with God freed from our possessions and positions. Jesus reminds us that the material goods that come into our lives do not belong absolutely to us. Everything on this earth belongs to God. We are only the stewards of what has come into our possession and we will be judged on how we make use of it. That leads, obviously, to the next warning that we cannot be at the same time give ourselves totally to God and become slaves of money and anything connected with wealth. We saw that in the case of the rich man who wanted to follow Jesus. He is possessed by his possessions and so could not surrender his life to Jesus. Many of us think we can and we try to compromise, but to give ourselves to God completely, we must become free of the lure of wealth and deeper still by an acquisitive mentality. I buy, therefore I am of the present world, is the dominant mindset and lifestyle. We end up being consumers and destroy the earth with our disposable mindset and behavior. 